Hi there, this is Chris with Shining 3D bringing you the latest update to AccuWare. In this video, we'll be going over the latest features added in the 3.1.8 update to our AccuWare slicing software. To start off, we've made some improvements to the one-click printing feature. You can now select orthodontic model as an option. Selecting this feature and hitting generate will automatically orient, stack, and support all the orthodontic models you have placed on the platform. The software will then slice the files and then send them directly to the printer. The sliced file will look something like this. This is a very efficient way to get a lot of output out of your printers. The sliced file results screen will now show you the material consumption in both milliliters and grams. This is very helpful for keeping track of how much resin you need to use per print. We have also added some additional settings to System Settings, About, and Option. There are now settings for the Z compensation to be automatically enabled. This will improve the Z directional printing accuracy by reducing any over cured material. The auto save project feature will automatically save the layout and support settings for your current project and store them locally on your PC. Fast printing will improve the printing speed of some materials when activated. One channel slice will reduce the file size of the output files on the LCD printer. This is both the L4D and the L4K printers. On the layout tab, we have added to the left hand side the auto drain hole feature. This will automatically add drain holes to the base of any model you have selected. As well, we have added the one-click shell and honeycomb feature. Once generated, this will create a honeycomb structure on the bottom of the model and add drain holes to the base as well. This is for improved structural stability and to prevent any warping post-curing. There are a few options that go along with this, including the honeycomb diameter, the honeycomb thickness, the honeycomb type, and the shell thickness. Updating to the latest version of AccuWare is very simple. When you start the software, it'll notify you if there's any updates, or you can go to Settings, System Settings, Check Update. Here you can see the current version of AccuWare you are running, as well as see any updates to the software the material packs or the language packs. Once you have obtained the installer.exe for the new version, you just run that, follow the on-screen instructions, and it will restart the software for you. And that is all for this update video. Thank you for watching.